Okay, we're at the river. Where am I taking you once we're over the bridge? I'm getting tired out of questions. Some shortcuts that'll slow him down. I don't care how you do it. Just shake him off. I think you zip it tight. We talk it through back at the bar. Okay, we're close. over in front of that bar. It's in the place. Yeah, that's the one. Wait here. What for? You want a little something from the Don or not?
compensation for your services, any damage to your car. This makes us square. I'm sure it's more than enough. Good. Don Salieri wants you to know that he's very grateful. So if you ever need anything, maybe a loan or some honest work, don't hesitate to ask. Don doesn't forget his friends. Yeah, okay, thanks. <sighs> One more thing. This matter stays between us. Anyone asks where you got that money, you want it at poker. The scratches on your car, you swerved to keep from hitting a little old lady. You got it? No, of course. See you around, kid. When I opened the envelope, I could have had a heart attack. Enough to fix the cap. <laughs> Nearly enough to buy a new one. I thought about what Sam said about work. I wasn't interested. Money was good, sure, but I didn't want to get in with criminals. Better to be poor and alive than rich and dead. So, right there, back then, I was out. After that night with Salieri's guys, I was back working as soon as I could. But it felt different. You get a lot of time with your thoughts when you're a cabbie. And other people's thoughts, too. You there, driver? Yes, ma'am. Are you driving or loitering? Driving, ma'am. Always driving. I have an appointment. So where to? St. Michael's Church, directly. Careful, please. I always drive careful. Then you'd be the first. Turn that racket off. I can't hear myself think. That's much better. So, church. It's Sunday already. Eyes on the road, please. this car at once. I'll walk the rest of the way.
extra! Get all the latest! Read all about it! Would you watch it, please?
art gallery. Give me that quick. Sure. Quick I can do. Oh, Christ, who taught you to drive? Taking some time out. What's it to you? Not much. Just talking. I'm paying you to drive, so do that. Look at him out there. The problem with this downturn is that it's made people lazy. Giving them an excuse. The work's not out there, pal. The work is always there. You just have to find it. I get it. You're a busy guy. I don't see so many these days. I saw this crapshoot depression coming. Saw them before the crash. So yeah, I get to be busy. Your busy day is gonna be looking at old paintings? I have a business meeting there with a colleague. Not that it's anything to do with you. If you ever find a real job, then maybe you'll understand. Until then, drive and quit bothering me. Yeah, yeah, I can get you. <laughs> Art gallery. Give me that quick. Sure. Quick I can do. Taking some time out. What's it to you? Not much. Just talking. I'm paying you to drive, so do that. Look at him out there. The problem with this downturn is that it's made people lazy. Giving them an excuse. The work's not out there, pal. The work is always there. You just have to find it. I get it. You're a busy guy. I don't see so many these days. I saw this crapshoot depression coming. Saw them before the crash. So yeah, I get to be busy. Your busy day is gonna be looking at old paintings? I have a business meeting there with a colleague. Not that it's anything. Hey, I said fast! I'm breakneck! I have a business meeting there with a colleague. Not that it's anything to do with you. If you ever find a real job, then maybe you'll understand. Until then, driving quit bothering me. Yeah, yeah, I can get you. Here's 50 cents. I don't spend it all at once. I'll try not to. Every fair today's been a son of a bitch. On to the next. Like shit. I've been working since five. What's your excuse? Move. Figures. Where are we going? Little Italy, 21st Street. Okay. If I don't tell the cops about the liquor on your breath, you don't tell them when I break the limit. Good deal. Great deal. Got any good fares today? Yeah, some. But never enough of them. Who's got the money for a cab ride since the market tanked and it all went to shit, I guess. Only reason I got you taking me places is I'm drunk and don't know better. Cops see enough drunk fellas. They're only after the people moving it and selling it. Yeah, but I've seen them go after guys for less. Yes, yeah, so if they think they can shake something out of you, they will use any excuse. 
They're not gonna be happy with you, I don't think. This city's corrupt as all hell. Sure is. Up here on, on the corner, please. I got the last hey, my cousin has a Ladies. coffee stand around the corner. Tell him Lucio sent you. Take a break, huh? Thanks. Might just do that. How you doing, pal? You remember me? Yeah? Huh? Mr. Morello's a little bent. Shouldn't go help in Salieri's goons, huh? I'm gonna have to give you a beating. Just so you always remember who runs this town. Make it so you won't do much walking for a while, eh? <laughs> Look at this guy. I didn't think he'd make it fun. Let's get him. How you doing, kid? Dino, Lou! You got business with the Don? Nah, we just trying to talk to that cabbie over there, that's all. That right. Yeah. 
Well, this here's the Don's favorite driver. So anything you gotta say to him, you can say to me. Is that right? Well, I'll tell you something, pal, we ain't leaving empty-handed, that's for sure. Well, then maybe you ain't leaving at all. Okay, then. See your boys around. Let's go, Lou. Thanks. At least we could do. Come on. Let's go say hi to the Don. Don Salieri? Yeah. He's gonna want to hear about this. What do they call you, son? Thomas. Thomas Angelo, sir. Frank told me you ran into some trouble? Yes, sir. My cab got smashed up pretty good. Morello's thugs went after him by the kind of time he helped us. This, uh, taxi, that's your livelihood? Yes, sir. I feel a sense of responsibility here. So I'm gonna set you up with a small loan, enough to get that cab of yours fixed up. I appreciate that, sir, but I'm not looking for a handout. Then what are we doing here? I just want a shot at the bastards who wrecked my cab. <laughs> you hear that, Frank? The kid wants my permission to get into a fight. Yes, I heard. Okay, Tommy Angelo. All the Morellas grills hang out at a bar he owns. Paul, you know the place. Sure do, boss. Good. You can ride along with Tommy. There's a lot right next to the bar where they park their cars. Go smash up a few tin cans, send Morello a message. He can't rough up hard-working Joes in my neighborhood without getting a black eye. Thank you, Mr. Salieri. I won't let you down. And Tommy, when you get back, we'll talk about what's next for you. No one else knows you here, so tread careful, okay? Sure. The boss finished yet? Nah, you got more time to sit on your ass. <sighs> Who's the new guy? Yeah. Find out. anything good? He's gonna drive Yeah, the I... I'm watching you. Got it? I get it. I hate sitting around. Pierre Is that system recording? Ah. See. See. Come back later. With Paul or Sam. The bars are closed. For you, I'm afraid. Anyways, I got places to be. Okay, come through this way. I'll take you to Vinny first. He's a loud mouth, but Frank and Adon have known him since forever. What's he do? We go see him whenever we need to do any uh, heavy lifting. We make sure we're well healed for when there's trouble. We're grateful for his dough, but we gotta go. Long drive back north. Be good. Move into the city this morning. Got to cops on every corner. Bagona Vincenzo! Ciao, Polly! 
Oh, she's gonna sing! <laughs> Who's this then? Rennie, this here's Tommy Angelou. We're doing a little job together. All right, good, good. Hey, you just need bean shooters or ruts? Nah, we just need something to write off a few cars. Huh. Oh, I got just the thing. This classic should do the trick! <laughs> <laughs> If the bat don't work out for use, I got a few cocktails here. Ay, ay, ay. Careful with them, though. Don't want to burn off your short ears. <laughs> Good to meet you, Tom. Let me know if Paulie gives you the hard time. I'll straighten them out. Come back and see me later if the boy Ralph, don't in the garage. He's a special oh, kind of idiot, yeah. but he's got a way with cars. I don't get how this moron gets interested in her, but I'm telling you, it's like some kind of black magic. Hey, genius! <laughs> get your head out of your ass! <laughs> Fuck you, Papa Polly. You can't, 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 can't just sneak up on a guy like that. Uh, I'm sorry, Ralphie. I'm just busting your balls. <laughs> see, 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 you're still a little limping. Guess we got two, 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 two cripples working here. <laughs> we ain't nothing alike. You got that, Ralph? Sh 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 sure, Papa Polly. Yeah. Tommy. Tommy Angelo. G good to meet you. Like I said. Ralphie here's a crack deck. Well, you bring him a stolen car, he'll make it yours. <laughs> 